This is a Channel Z special report. I'm Zion Villain, and here's the story. Haitian President Jovenel Moise was shot to death in his home by militants dressed as U.S. drug enforcement agents. He was 53 years old. The attack happened at 1 in the morning local time near the island's capital of Port-au-Prince. Haiti's First Lady Martine Moise was also wounded in the attack. She was flown to Miami for treatment and remains in critical but stable condition, according to the New York Post. CNN reports that an arrested suspect identified as 63-year-old Christian Emmanuel Sinone entered the country on a private jet in June. Police did not say what Sinone would be charged with or what his motives may have been, beyond saying that he arrived with political intentions. Sinone is alleged to have been in touch with a Florida-based Venezuelan security firm to recruit 26 Colombian mercenaries and two Haitian Americans. Police have previously said that a group of at least 28 people are suspected in the killing. At least 20 of those suspects have been detained, including two American nationals. Three suspects have been killed while a mass manhunt is underway for the five suspects still on the loose. Claude Joseph has assumed the island's leadership and is now prime minister. Haiti remains in a state of emergency. Prior to his death, Moise was accused by opposition leaders of overstaying his term, which they say began after his 2017 election and was supposed to have ended in February of this year.